And now for the uh, spelling B for Friday, December the 22nd, I found 23 words. And that was amazing, but uh, not up to my usual standards. I didn't have enough time, did not find the pangram so, so, so far. And I'm going to take a look at the hints. And that is the spelling bee forum page for Friday. And there are a total of 31 words, one pangram. So I've got about eight words left, including pangram. And here are the stats. Lots of grays towards the bottom and a, and a few towards the middle. Let's take a look at the clues. All the C's here, I'm gonna reveal. Brown bacteria, oh, I know there's C-O-C-C-I. Waffles shape when used for ice cream. Uh, it's going to be C O N I conic 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 conical. I didn't get that, huh? How about that? Conic. So let's get that C O C C I. And I got the second highest level. And conic. And just in case if you guys hear all these sirens going, uh, I'm taking a break and um, drinking a smoothie here. And there's just a lot of stuff happening all around me. So let's see now. I got the C's. Let's take a look at the G's. A dash, a dash show is an open mic night where audience members, oh, that's the gong show, G-O-N-G. -G. Striking metal disc to make sound. I think that's going to be something G-O-N-G something tearing our eyes out or oh, that's going to be gouging or oh, that's going to be gonging or gonging or whatever so G-O-N-G and then G-O-N-G I-N-G and then um, tearing our eyes out. G O U J, perhaps. Usually it's spelled with Z. It's going to be G G O U G I N G. Yeah. There we go. So got all those, got all the I's, let's take a look at the J's, jolting in up-down manner, American Sparrow genus, species, H-Y-E-M-A-L-I-S, don't know the name of this bird. J U. No, it's not, not calling anything. And then here at the end, a representative of the Pope. Madrid's full of them. And you. Don't know this. I know cardinals, but not what what something that starts with N U. Here are the O's. Yeah, the use. I'm gonna be stuck with three words I think shy of a queen B at the end and the two G the J's and they're all towards the very bottom so nothing to be ashamed of those three are pretty tough and there's a pangram too let's take a look at the uh, hints here customized hints One of them is like a ending with ing. Let's see. 
yeah, that's the ING ending. And with multiple ends. Controlled thing in up down manner. Blank. So I think I have to be, I will have to be happy with three words shy of a queen bee. And I did pretty well in all the other games. Um, I did find uh, flight is mini. I did connections, I did water, I did coral. So I've got four. So four out of five is pretty good. That's a grand slam. And yesterday I had a Wowza 5 out of 6, and the day before I had um, another Wowza, I had, a, I think I had um, a 5 out of 5. So, the last 3 days I've been doing pretty well, um, should be very happy. And so I'm going to close it out, today's Friday's What's Possible, with this, with 3 was shy of a Queen Bee, and, and, um, Thank you for watching and listening as always. Uh, good luck with all your plays. Have a great, have a great weekend and come back uh, again tomorrow for more games, okay? Take care, bye for now.